Hashtag clickbait. Hello, and welcome to the set of my YouTube channel. Um, I usually have it up closer so you can't see all this, but today is a special occasion and I'm going to be redecorating the set of my YouTube for the holidays. I love the winter holidays. Hey Thanksgiving. Julia was here last night and then also this morning we went on a hike today and last night we worked on some Christmas stuff, we made some holiday crafts, and we also put together my new Christmas playlist because my old one got deleted somehow. So you can go to my Spotify and follow that playlist along with many others. Because I'm currently living with my dad, I don't have my own place, which is really tragic because I love decorating my own place for the holidays. I'm going to be decorating this wall, which is really the only available wall um, in my room to decorate. And I figure since I record my videos on this wall, I may as well just like record a video of me putting them up. That way I can see what it's going to look like as I'm doing it. You might be wondering, like, Jesse, why are you not wearing a shirt? And it's because I think that all holidays need a sex symbol and, um, I volunteered to be the sex symbol of Christmas. The first thing I did was make a ton of this bunting. Um, I made this bunting last year and put it on my mantle, on my fireplace. Um, and I'm gonna just kind of string it and see see what looks good um, on the set of my YouTube channel. I made this out of literally twine and I cut triangles and paper and then like cut holes and put it in. So DIY tip, do, do that. You don't even really need instructions. You might want to tape the ends so you can feed it through the holes and it doesn't get frayed, I'm just saying. So far, I really like it. This is what it's gonna look like, all zoomed up. This is set building and building a theme, building a vibe, and building a mood, and building a community. And all you have to do is click subscribe. If you thought this was it, that all we did was cut some triangles and put it on string, got another thing coming because Julia is crafty like, well, I mean, I wouldn't say like no other, but she's like really crafty. Julia made these adorable origami stars and then put them on strings. So what I'm going to do is tape them to the ceiling and hang them strategically to create a 3D vibe. Depth in the set, depth in the character that is me. You're welcome. This is how quality content is generated. Feeling that Christmas vibe. There's a couple more pieces that I could have put up, but part of minimalist aesthetic is knowing when to stop. And I think that this is pretty good. At some point I'll probably get some more twinkly lights. I think that will really enhance the aesthetic and we'll kind of see where we go from there, but for now I really like this. I hope this video was a nice little break from whatever you've got going on. And um, don't forget that you can decorate for Christmas as early as you want. I mean, I do suggest November 1st, but if you wanted to go earlier, I wouldn't be the person to shame you. I would support you 500%. It's all about that shot. And what if I call this like, sexy holiday decorating? And then people come and then it's just me shirtless decorating for the holidays in a totally non-sexy way. That sounds like something I would do.